The first day of school is now in the books for thousands of students in the San Diego Unified School District and fewer COVID protocols are in place. Indoor masking is not required and neither are vaccines. Both are just strongly recommended for now. ABC 10 News reporter Sierra Encinas shows us how students and families are adjusting to the new school year. Parents were safe by the bell before 8.30 this morning when thousands of students made their way back to school. It felt very nerve-wracking, but also exciting in a weird way. Alaric and Amelia both attend Garfield Elementary and wrapped up their first day saying it was fun and cool, but it was a bittersweet moment for their mom, Gisela Laura. Because we get used to having them full-time, you know, in the summer, so now they're back to school and I'm like, oh, my babies, they have to go back to school, but, you know, it's, it's a good thing. San Diego Unified Superintendent Lamont Jackson says this school year, equity is priority. It will be about making sure that we see and we hear each and every child that they have a sense of belonging in our community and in our school. Jackson adds safety and physical, mental and social wellness are also top of mind. This is the first school year since 2020 that students will be able to leave the mask at home if they choose. Something Laura says is a sign things are getting back to normal. I know we still have to be very cautious, still wash our hands all the time, use sanitizer, but you know, it feels it feels semi back to normal. Yes, it's it's freeing. Laura's students say they're excited to learn this year. I'm looking forward to um, making new friends. And I am looking forward to just having good grades and trying just to not get into a, a lot of trouble. Sierra and Cenas, ABC 10 News. And the district is still dealing with the teacher shortage. San Diego Unified leaders say this school year they will also focus on recruiting and retaining staff throughout the district.